Our recent storms and the king tides created all kinds of problems for the Bay Area, as you know, and with climate change, these events could get even worse. ABC 7 News reporter Luz Pena is live in San Francisco along the Embarcadero with a look at what is being done to prevent bigger problems in the future, Luz. Yes, Dan, climate experts tell us King Tides did a great job at exposing those problematic areas in the Bay. And even though it's not raining right now, they tell us that weather event that we just experienced, you should expect it to happen again. After a storm coupled with record King Tides swept the Bay Area, residents are now processing the reality that this can happen again. As far as we know, it's the uh, biggest tide and storm uh, at the same time that we've had in about 30 years here. Over the weekend, this neighborhood in Larkspur flooded. Water entered garages as residents came out in kayaks and paddle boards. We had to, you know, kind of swim in and out. With a break in the rain, garages were open, airing out the damage. This has been happening for generations as well, so I think it's just some of the ongoing things we deal with mother nature. This video from the UC Santa Cruz Center for Coastal Climate Resilience shows a visualization of San Mateo County, an area that faces significant sea level rise impacts. This is what they're projecting during a hundred year storm. Professor Mike Beck, director of this center, is watching what's happening closely. King tides give us a good picture into um, uh, what future sea levels can look like and the problems that that creates. In the current events, you can see that those problems, particularly this time of year, are going to be quite commonly coupled with rainwater um, uh, and strong winds. So the strong winds are going to be pushing those tidal waters even higher up on us. With rising sea levels due to climate change, Professor Beck said king tides are to be expected. Usually talking two, three, sometimes depending upon uh, what we're looking at, the average four feet of water uh, uh, additional with the high tide.